everyone done. I enjoy listening and watching your module one discussion initial post. Like you said, if a person comes in with um, hypertensive crisis or um, sepsis, leaf bed is a choice drug to go to. Um, I like the fact that you explained how leaf bed works. This is important for us as nurses. Also knowing that it's excreted from the kidneys, um, a major nursing intervention is to monitor output. Um, there has been times where I know from my experience that a person is placed on two, two pressors and our output gets diminished just because either vasoconstriction, the kidneys not getting the blood flow they need and not making the output that the body needs to do. So that is an important intervention. There's times in that I've worked that a person's on three or four different antibiotics, two or three pressors, three or four things for sedation, and you question how effective it is for the patient. How is the patient getting what they're supposed to? When you really break it down and you think about the, the liver metabolizing the kidneys or excretion, excreting, how hard is it on these organs for the drugs that we're given? Is the good outweighing the bad? Um, I thought your post was spot on. It was great. I just couldn't find anything on pharmacogenetics. I think that would be very interesting to find something on pharmacogenetics for early fed or vancomycin. Um, but I couldn't find anything. The resources I used for um, my information in this post was uh, Medscape.com and um, RxList. Love Thank you.